Hey guys, hope you're all doing well. So today I'm basically just going to sit down and do my makeup on camera because in the last week I haven't really had a chance to because of all my exams and stuff. So I just wanted to come here and have a talk with you guys and just kind of chill out for a second. So if you want to see how to get this look, but not really because this isn't a tutorial, <laughs> then keep on watching. So I just realized that my lights are basically non-existent right now. <laughs> And my dog is barking. Wow. What a good start to a video. What am I doing? What foundation am I using? Should I use this one? I don't know. But to start off, I'm just going to be using the MAC Strobe Cream. So, how are you guys doing? Hopefully for the people that watch that are my age, we have just finished QCS test and... Wow, I'm so glad that it's over. So I basically am making this video today just to have a little rant about it and everything else because they literally put QCS on at the worst possible time. Like, we have every other assignment due and every other exam. We have block exams next week and QCS has been the last two days and I'm so off it. Oh my god. Everyone's like, okay, can I go home and study now? Oh, nope. You have to get a good night's sleep for like six hours of testing the next day. So I'm just taking this opportunity to actually wear a full face of makeup because I haven't had time for that the last two days and I want to so I'm going to. I think, oh, oh my god, I think I'm out of this foundation. I've never run out of a foundation before. It's not hard to believe but like seriously I've never run out of a foundation before. Oh this is tragic. Not really but you know I'm just being dramatic. I'll actually be so upset i out of this. I don't hear anything at all in the bottle, so that's great news. Okay, just adding my usual shape tape. Oh. Okay, now for probably the messiest powder that I own. The Youngblood Mineral Rice Setting Powder. Okay, and because I've already opened it, I might as well just chuck this on the rest of my face, because might as well. Oh, it's going everywhere. Mmm, love it. Oh, well, I see, it's just powder flying everywhere and this is the really messy part it's doing it back up it just waterfalls all over my floor all over my clothes all over my life mm. I want to sneeze so bad that powder is so triggering for me how long do you reckon it'll take me to sneeze don't you just hate it when you're in an exam and you're having a really good daydream but you have to be working and you literally make it your goal to finish as soon as possible so you can continue with your daydream. That's what was happening to me. It was really good and then I realized that the test was started. I was like, um, I should probably like start working and then I can finish my daydream at the end of it. What kept you guys going? I wanna know, comment down below. What was your motivation to finish? Apart from, you know, like an OP. <laughs> If any of you guys have done QCS and you aren't already on the QCS discussion page, man, you need to get there because it is fire right there. Like, there is, like, everything's happening. I really need to get Hula Light because I've never liked this one too much. It's always been a little orange. On me, anyways. Because I'm, like, white as a piece of paper. I'm actually going to contour today because why the hell not? I don't even know what look I'm doing today. Hey, maybe I should try and do something that makes me like not look tired. Because I probably look really tired right now. <laughs> I'm just going in with this blush that literally does like nothing. I'm actually going to use this palette today because I do not use this thing enough for how much it was. So <laughs> I'm just going to mix these two shades here. really wish I had a colour that matches the designs on this shirt for this look. That would be really cool, but 
pretty sure I don't. <laughs> going to go with my beloved Shanexo palette and just use the yellow kind of shade in my crease. And I'm going to pack the light shimmery shade basically all over my eyelid. I feel like I should be telling you guys a story. Do you want to hear a story? No, I feel like I'll just drag it out and then my story will go on for like three hours. I just added some sparkle to my lower lash line. What next? I'm just going to chuck my normal nude eyeliner in my waterline. When do I don't? When do I... Wow, that made... Was that English? Does that make sense? Oh my god, now I'm thinking really hard about it. And it's really hard to think hard after QCS because I've literally just spent two days non-stop thinking and I feel absolutely great about it. Doesn't everyone? Yeah, I'm just going to very lightly fill in my brows real quick. So let's use the Anastasia Beverly Hills Perfect Brow Pencil in not the right shade, but oh well. Oh, so it's probably just going to change the shirt, change my lip colour and then go back to normal me because this is a lot of colours that I'm wearing right now and I am so not used to it. I'm going to set it with my usual brow gel and oh my god, I'm actually going to be saying spray today. Wow, that smells so strong. It is like, is it watermelon? Is that what it's meant to be? It's gonna make me sneeze. Does anyone else's wrist click when they do this? <laughs> Am I weird? I feel like I should put lashes on, but I'm not wearing any eyeliner, so I can't really hide the lash band, so I'm not gonna take that risk. <laughs> when I accidentally get too close to their, like, the root of their eyelashes when they do mascara, it just, like, pinches their, eye like, eyelid. Cause I just did that and I wanna cry. <laughs> way too much mascara on that one bottom lash. Okay, well, that only took 17 hours. Great. Are we up to lips already? That so fast. Probably because I'm literally doing like no makeup whatsoever. I probably could do liner, but I really don't want to. Going in first with this Kevin Aquan medium lip pencil. And now I'm just chucking on this lippy stick by Colourpop in the shade Brick. That is pretty much it. Uh, I know this wasn't anything too showing up, but I just wanted to take her out and sit down and do my makeup and film it because why not? <laughs> I just, I've been so stressed this week and it's been so nice just to sit down and put on a full face of makeup and actually look like I've had eight hours sleep. So anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed the video and I'll see you guys all next week. Bye!